Cherry Blossoms greeted Milton's outstanding young community leaders last night at the Seniors Activity Centre. The gathering was to award individuals for their contributions to the area. Among the distinguished attendees were current community leaders gathered to honour and celebrate these remarkable individuals. We're here this evening uh, at the Senior Centre to recognise the best of the best. And when I talk about the best of the best, I talk about the youth of our community. I'm here to participate and recognise those young people that's future leaders here, not only in the town of Melton, the region of Halton, province of Ontario, but this great nation of Canada here. So the best of the best is here tonight. I think in my eyes, everyone who uh, is recommended or uh, is in that list, uh, in my eyes, have already won an award for being here and for being present and for being involved. Because I think that's one of the most important things, being involved, and it's one of the hardest things to do. I'm here today because it's important to recognize some incredible young people that make us such a complete and connected community and a place of possibility. You know, young people are the majority of the demographic if you look at the statistics in the town of Milton. And it's very important to recognize the leaders of tomorrow. And you're going to see some incredible young people here tonight who have achieved so much at such a young age. The event was organized by the Milton Youth Task Force. Kelly McKay is the Youth Recreation Coordinator for the town. She said it was challenging for the group to select the evening's honorees. Tonight we're honoring 10 award winners. Um, nine of them are youth and one of them is a youth group. Uh, they are outstanding youth in our community who the Milton Youth Task Force had the opportunity to look through all these nominations and select out of that pile of nominees uh, to find who they best felt really represented their community and really gave back to their community as well too. The list of achievements of each of this year's recipients was extensive. Kofi Boateng was recognized as both the Athlete of the Year and Entrepreneur of the Year. Among his many accomplishments was the creation of a business with a special target demographic. Kofi's Lawn Care is a lawn care uh, service provider that specifically catered to senior citizens. Um, went all around Halton, Peel, marketed it online, in person, I had yard signs even, so really great experience overall. Shrina Sribalan also took home two awards. She was recognized as the Youth Mentor of the Year as well as Youth Champion of the Year. She emphasized the importance for youth to participate in the community they call home. It's so important for people to get involved, whether it's in volunteer work, whether it's in community work, just one, to give back to the community that we're all a part of, to feel that sense of identity of the home, especially of a great home like Halton, like Milton. This event is really special to me because youth are so overlooked. We often think of our seniors and we think of our children and we even think of our working members, but never our youth. But thinking about the contributions of Milton's youth was the goal for the evening. And it's a goal Adil Kalki says was achieved. The award component for this, this particular part of the task force really helps, you know, emphasize to young people that their work is being noticed and recognized. Enjoying the company of tomorrow's community leaders in Milton, I'm Dee Glazebrook for Halton News.